all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how you can integrate Interact with Zoho CRM. So let's get right into it. Now, uh, Interact does require a WhatsApp business account, which I don't have. So that is the reason I'm going to be using this since I cannot really show you guys exactly what you need to do because you do need a WhatsApp business account to integrate everything seamlessly. Now, the steps to integrating this is you need to sign up and log in to interact and you need to have active accounts in both Zoho CRM and interact. And if you have an existing account, you can just log in and head over to the interact uh, integration section on interact. Now, once you get to that screen or that section, you need to select Zoho CRM and then proceed ahead. Then you need to select the workflow template. You can choose whichever template you have here. Uh, there are, as you can see, three available in this screenshot over here. And you just need to select it and input all the information needed. You also have your webhook over here, uh, which you can use to connect everything. And you can easily uh, use that integration. Now, to connect uh, this, you just need to install the workflow and then click on edit settings and authenticate your account by providing the api key which i've mentioned previously which is i'm pretty sure related to the webhook url and you just need the api keys and credentials and for interact you just need to authenticate your account similarly and that should be it now once you're done with that you need to configure flow uh, by under flow configuration you need to map the relevant data fields between zoho crm and interact to make sure that all the information is set up properly and the first name last name phone number and email a need to be synced in between those two so make sure you enter everything uh, which is on zoho crm and interact then you need to activate the workflow uh, just to enable real-time synchronization and automation auto yeah, automation or automation. And that should be it for the interact side of things. Now for Zoho, uh, after everything is configured and activated, you need to add back to connection uh, to copy the webhook URL, which will be configured on Zoho CRM, then log into your account and go into the settings section, then go into workflow rules under automation. And that looks something like this. If I go into my setup under automation, you have workflow rules. So just click here. And then you just need to select an existing workflow or create a new rule and then edit the rule settings and configure the URL webhook generated on interact. And that should be it. Once you're done with that, you just need to save. Uh, you need to ensure that the method is post and the body has this JSON code added uh, with this basis on leads or deals modules that you are updating. And yeah, that is pretty much how you integrate both of those services. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.